Now, you know, Carol, I feel like I haven't spoken to you today much. Doesn't it feel like we're almost being rewarded with all this sunshine after the Lioness's great performance? Oh, isn't it lovely? On all counts, Naga, I must say, it's nice to see a bit of sunshine. It does raise your spirits, and we're certainly going to see that today. But as we go through tomorrow, the weather's going to change for a day in a bit as we see a return to rain moving in from the southwest, pushing northeastwards, clearing the far northeast early doors on Saturday. Then things settle down away from the northwest where we'll hang on to some showers. But for the rest of us, it will be mostly dry. Today, if you're just stepping out and you have an allergy to wheat pollen, we're looking at high levels across Wales and all of England. Now, we've got some cloud at the moment across parts of Scotland and northeast England. That should tend to break up. We've also got some cloud lapping onshore from the English Channel across some southern counties. But in between, a lot of blue skies. Through the day, we'll see some fair weather cloud bubble up and there's a chance we could catch an isolated shower. The breeze picking up as well, so it's an onshore breeze along the North Sea coastline. So here it will feel a bit cooler, but we could reach 27 degrees somewhere in Hampshire, 26 somewhere in North West Wales through today. This evening and overnight, again, a lot of clear skies to start, but then through the night, the cloud will build from the southwest, heralding the arrival of a weather front, which is going to bring in some heavy and potentially thundery rain by the morning, and increasingly, it's going to feel humid. So tomorrow, many of us will start off on a dry note, but here's our band of heavy rain, thundery rain, pushing northwards. There'll be a drier slot behind it, and then more heavy rain pushes in through the course of the afternoon, again with the odd rumble of thunder gusty winds along the northwest coast of Wales and we're also looking at it turning quite humid in southern areas but it will be fresher across the far north of Scotland and here Naga it will actually feel quite pleasant in the sunshine. Certain, certainly looks it. Thanks very much Carol, speak to you a bit later. We'll